This is going to be an unboxing of the Guy 10 Plus from Goal Zero. As you guys may have seen with my previous videos, I've had the Nomad 27, the Sherpa 120, and a bunch of different Goal Zero products. The reason I like their products so much is because they are very simple to use. They actually work as advertised instead of having to get all these other stuff to go with it. And they just, just work. I'm like other solar products I've used in the past and the goal zero just like you put it in the sun you connect your device and it's charging you don't have to do anything else and just makes it really simple and that's why I like them so much the reason I'm buying so much is not just like I want to have power out in the when I'm out camping or whatever I want to I'm fascinated with solar energy and to have a company that makes it just affordable relatively to get this stuff and make it easy to use is why I'm glad Goal Zero exists now. But you see here you got your 7 watt Nomad 7 panel right here and fold this. This plastic out of your way. Let's go ahead and have plastic help get rid of some of these scratches that you might find on here. There's more pl plastic. Pull this off. Good they have that keep scratches from forming during shipping and such but that's about how big it is my hand here about how big your Nomad 7 is you have also in the box you have this zip tied in your battery pack come out yep you have a Goal Zero Guide 10 Plus which what this means is the plus means it can charge up to one amp of power and so it can charge your iPod slash the newer iPhones and newer phones that require w one app to charge or high power charge devices any of them it has various things on the back here um, it can, has an adapter you can female um, cigarette lighter adapter so you can actually plug this in and um, run a regular uh, car charger off of your phone in case your phone is not compatible with USB. This is read before first use. It says only use nickel metal hydride batteries and nothing else. Which means you don't have to have Goal Zero's batteries as long as you have nickel metal hydride. You're good. I have instructions here that I'll probably look over after to make sure I don't miss anything. And that appears to be all that's in the box here like it says you get one three hour charge time uh, it takes about yeah three hours about in full sunlight to charge your batteries this battery pack here it should or maybe not if not you can get an adapter to charge AAA batteries in this I got some of those as well because I have some devices that use AAA but I'm not sure if this is a multi-purpose adapter or not now, but in the old Guide 10, Guide 7, you used to uh, have to have an adapter to charge AAAs, but I will put that in the description down below if I figure that out, if it can charge AAAs without an adapter, or you can just plug them in to this. But that's it, it seems like I'll just give you a little thing, show you what how this is supposed to be used. You can actually put this battery pack right in here, tuck that away, plug your cord in, um, tie this here. And you can plug in this if you want to just directly female adapter, like from this right here. Or you can plug in, what most people do. Plug in USB on your panel here. And then you plug into your Guy 10 Plus. You store this in here. You strap this up using the little hooks here to the back of your backpack. And then 
you can just velcro this in so it doesn't fall out like that you can just tuck this wire in and whatever on the, your backpack you now have your battery charging as your backpack in a walk-in or anything else you can just put this ready on any backpack it should fit and just anywhere and it's heavy duty I've seen these being stomped on as long as you don't fold it purposely fold it in half it shouldn't break because I've seen them stomp on them water resistance if you're growing in a river it won't break obviously it could sh short circuit it if you have electricity flowing through it so I wouldn't recommend they put it in water but otherwise uh, that's what you get with your guide Nomad 7 I'm getting it mixed up the Nomad 7 by Goal Zero if you have any questions comment below the review would can't tell you when that's going to come out. I hope they get the reviews on all of these out by the end of fall since that's when I'm going to be using them throughout camp and hiking and other stuff. I'm going to hope to be using these throughout fall, give you some usage videos, stuff like that. But if you have any questions, comment below, subscribe for more of these type of videos, and I'll see you in the next video.